Hi, I'm Jim Clark. To my right, Walsh head tennis coach Brian Whitaker. And Brian is so called off, week, but not really. You're at the ITAs and boy, great competition at that tournament. Yeah, it's really tough. It's the first time we had taken um, any team since we trans, trans, uh, transitioned over to Division Two to the ITAs, and it was a good experience for us. The girls got to see some really good competition. And looking back, Alicia Angle won the B's Consolation Singles Division and played well. Yeah, she played very well. She had um, she had a tough first round match that was really close. She could have pulled that out, uh, but after uh, getting through that that loss, she recovered well and and won the rest of her matches and did a great job in the final. Overall, I guess a nice break from the GLIAC schedule, playing those folks in the middle of this GLIAC schedule. I actually, I really enjoyed that, and I think the women did too. It was a great experience for them to get that kind of competition without the stress of the GLIAC conference uh, schedule being on them. So it was a good experience. Back this week with it, though, and on the road to boot at Northwood, very good team, 5-0. and That's up first for us. Yeah, Northwood's always one of the best two teams in the conference every year. They just kind of reload year after year. They've got some very talented freshmen in at the top of their lineup to go along with their returners that were already good from last year. So it'll be a tough match for us. But again, uh, there's not a lot of pressure on us when it comes to playing Northwood. Then Saginaw, two and four, but you're on the road. It's after Northwood. It makes it tough. It does. Saginaw is an, an improved team from last year. They had a couple uh, good recruits come in. Uh, I did get to see some of their players play at the ITAs this past weekend. So it's going to be a match we're going to have to show up for and play well. It looks like you're in a spot where things are coming together when you want them to. Yeah, it's good. I felt like last year we started the season off with a couple losses against two very uh, good teams, and then we kind of peaked and then kind of got tired at the end of the season. I feel like this year uh, we haven't peaked yet. We're kind of moving in the right direction, and that's a good thing. Thanks, Brian. Good luck this weekend. Thank you. Cavs on the road, Northwood first, then Saginaw. I'm Jim Clark. We'll talk to you next week.